The construction of the Inia NATO Care Unit was launched during the World Prematurity Day held at the Mbarara University of Science and Technology Pharmacology Theatre, Boma Mbarara City. The ceremony was graced by several dignitaries, including the Mbarara District Woman Member of Parliament, Margaret Ayebale, who is also a member of the Parliamentary Health Committee. Leave days of the mothers who give birth to preterm babies. We all know it is uh, public knowledge that every mother who gives birth and is working, whether in private sector or public sector, is given three months of leave. But when you look at what these mothers were talking about, it's like even the three months are over when the mother is still in the hospital. And by the time the months are done and the mother is taken back to, to, to their respective homes with these babies, it's when this baby needs more care. It really requires more care than anything else. So that's why I'm coming out to advocate for more leave days for mothers who give birth to preterm babies. The new building that's been constructed is entirely a neonatal intensive care unit for all our newborns. It is a five level uh, building and it's going to uh, be completed by June next year. And uh, it will be able to house at least 100 beds, that's 100 babies and more if there is need. And it will also have all the services the newborn will ever need. And we hope that uh, that is going to cost us about $2 million um, to construct and another $1.5 million to equip and then many health workers to run it. The journey is just beginning. You have given us a home for newborn babies, but we are asking for more. What are we asking for? We are asking you for staff. Nursing, medical specialists. Construction program funded by the World Bank through the Ministry of Health is designed to provide adequate space and adverse care for newborns requiring specialized attention. The neonatal care unit is being constructed in partnership with UNICEF, USAID, World Health Organization, World Bank, 